reward of having this starter team. Make it a beast team. We'd obviously get yourself on the description below. Get yourself to use 7 buy. Get yourself some cheap, reliable coins. And don't forget to use King with a cheeky 6% off. Right, let's get into the video. Yo guys, what's going on? King Flipper here and welcome to another Icon SBC video. Today we have the man himself, the Prime Icon, Nemanja Vidic. Nemanja, why did I say Jay? Nemanja Vidic, why have I said... Ignore what I've just done. <laughs> uh, here you go, here's your stats of this card, medium high. Really good stats, it's a decent looking card. Um, it's a shame it's not his World Cup Icon one, because that would have been unbelievable. Um, five SBCs to do, most of you will know you always get a born legend and rising star. Of course, uh, this is out for quite a while, so it's out for like three months. Um, I'm giving you the prices now of Footbin Bright now. Actually, no, these are by Footbin Bright now prices. Um, so you're looking at 400 coins by now at the moment for rare bronzes. Uh, so you're looking at 4.4k to do the Born Legend one. Obviously, your main reward is a 5k pack. Same with the Rising Star, which is all silvers. The good thing is, it's only, it's only, they're only 100 coins more at the moment than rare bronzes. Uh, these are 500 coins each. Obviously, bids and snobs will always be cheaper, but don't forget, prices do, of course, fluctuate. Uh, so yeah, this is 5.5k to do, a little bit more expensive than your two rare gold players pack, which is a 5k pack. Let me start off with a nice. Nice little cheap SBC, the Manchester Wall SBC. As I was saying, foot bin buying now prices. Time doing this SBC, which has been out for a couple of hours. Uh, bids and snobs will always be cheaper. And don't forget, prices do fluctuate. Uh, at the moment, when this SBC come out, prices are very high. So hopefully, fingers crossed, prices will have come down. If you're doing this in team of the season, it's literally for the cheapest chips. I guarantee it'll be cheapest chips, which is good to see. So requirements to the Manchester Wall: you do need one Man United player. McTominay is the cheapest 80 rated card at the moment. Just bear that in mind. Uh, team of 81, Smackman 81 can't lower anyone else. We have 11 players in squad. It's 981s and 280s, which is easy peasy. At the moment, your 81s are 700 coins each. Once it lets me load in to show you the players, uh, we got. While it's deciding to do whatever it's want, we got Rodriguez, Basuma, Indica, Pasalic, Andrijk, uh, Forsberg, Kulisevsky, Musso, and Terreira. Uh, Terraria, Terreira, depends on how you want to pronounce it. Uh, Nine of your cheapest 81s, they're 700 coins at the moment. Uh, McTominay, as I said, is your cheapest 80 rated card uh, from uh, Man United. He's 850, so they have gone up in price, but they'll be mid price soon. Because the people who really want to do this will have sorted it out. And then Campbell, uh, non-red gold, uh, 80 rated, of course, are cheaper. And you're looking at 600 coins uh, by it now for them at the moment. You'll be able to get them cheaper on that with bids. And as I said, fodder is a little bit high, so this should come back down. You're looking at 7.75k to do this at the moment by it now. Uh, you do get yourself a small prime Electrum players pack. Uh, no, small. No, small prime gold players pack if I remember right uh, I'll check it in a minute when obviously we uh, this finishes loading so your main reward is your small prime gold players pack which is a 22.5k pack after I'd waited forever for it to decide to go back to normal then we get into the league legend SBC requirements of this one you need one prem player I've got five so you don't need to worry about that you do need a team of the week or you can use a foot champions card at the moment the best is your 87 rated because 87 rated team of the week are exactly the same price as your normal cards as well team of 85 with smackman 85 can't lower anyone else with 11 players in squad uh, your cheapest uh, 287s 984s of course at the moment moment prices are inflated and depends on when you're watching it just check your special 87s because some of them might be worth less than a normal gold uh, so yeah so canal is at the moment cheapest 87 rated in form at 27k larice is one of them at larice is not cheap one of the cheapest normal gold players at 27k there is a couple of special cards that are coming up at 26 26 and a half k so just bear that in mind and your 84s at the moment are 5.7k each hopefully they'll be cheaper whenever you're watching this so you've got diaz uh, felix Free Kish, Insigne, Chiellini, Handanovic, Sane, Perisic, and Mertens. None of your cheapest 84s at the moment. As I said, they're not cheap. They're 5.7k each. So this is over 100k. This is the most expensive I've ever seen an 85 rated team. 105.3k to do. Ugh. Prime Mix Players Pack is a 20k pack, but it's not really worth it. And then we jump into an 86, uh, which again is not cheap. So uh, cheapest way to do an 86 rated team uh, is 388s, 186 584s and 283s. Um, again, 
88, 37k each at the moment. They were 30k before the showdown SBC. So yeah, these are 37k at the moment. To Stegen, Cancelo's new card has finally been added for the uh, Bayern Munich and Ruben Diaz. 37k each. Uh, Brozovic is 18.25k. Uh, one of the cheapest 86s, again, very inflated. And then, obviously, your 84s are 5.7. So you've got Felix, Grealish, Insigne, Chiellini, and Nandanovic. And your 83s are inflated as well, 3K each. Fernando and Pal Torres. Hopefully, they do come back down in price because that's ridiculous. This is, yeah, this is really ridiculous. 163.75K. That's nearly the price of an 87-rated team not that long ago. Nearly that price. It's ridiculous. This, this should normally be about 120, 130. So this is at least 30k of a price at the moment, which is absolutely horrendous. Uh, small red gold players pack is a 25k pack. Uh, so at the moment, Prime Vidic is actually not even that bad now. Um, it's 286.7k buy now if you have to buy all the players. Most of you won't have to do that. You get 77.5k worth of packs, which is not bad either. Uh, I've had a look at a tradable card. It's coming up at 295k buy now. So at the moment, the SBC actually is cheaper than the actual tradable card. And this, as I said, this is the highest I've ever seen fodder. So after maybe the showdown uh, SBCs when this come out, this might be cheaper. As I said, this will be out for when Team of the Season's out. So it will be literally cheap as chips. Brosters you can throw in as fodder and you get this card. So yeah. Um, comments below. Let me know what you think. Do you think it's actually not a bad looking card? Uh, it looks decent. So yeah. Um, hopefully I did save you some time and some money with this. Feel free to drop a thumbs up. Of course it does help the channel and the video. Obviously if you're new and you want to see more SBC videos like this. I've got Barnes to do as well. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you got that notification bell on so you can keep up to date as soon as I upload these. Other than that. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video stream. Take it easy obviously. Peace. Yeah.